Okay, sounds like we're on. Um, I'm leaving the house, my house, in the morning for work. Uh, it's not that far. Uh, a walk, about 20 minutes. I make it there in 22 minutes. Um, I'll put it up on the screen for you guys. For these, those of you that don't know me personally, or those of you that are just watching this for the first time, my name is William Pagan. I am a gun tech at Impact Action Sports, which is a paintball field in Tualatin, Oregon. And Tualatin is a little city outside of Portland, Oregon. Um, this is just a vlog that I created so that my friends and family back in my home state um, can see what I do daily and see how I've been kind of keep up with me so a little shout out to Albuquerque New Mexico yeah uh, I moved here about a year ago on August 6 um, it's a regular Friday heading to work traffic's kind of calm I love walking in Oregon in the morning the trees, the temperature, it's really nice. So, getting into this, basically, I'm just going to show you what I do daily. What things I go through on the daily and what tasks I have to do. Uh, I make this short little walk to work sometimes and sometimes I get picked up by my manager. Her name's Morgan and that's more on the weekends. You guys will see her. I'll have some, some footage of her. She's a really cool lady. So it kind of gets sketchy at this part because the sidewalk ends and there's just like this little uh, path to walk on which turns into dirt and then it's a little even more sketchy because like that little path ends a little bit farther down. As you can see here it is when you're walking all of a sudden this overgrowth right here on the side of the street blocks your path so there's no way for you to get in and you have to wait for the cars to pass and then you can walk in the semi middle of the street. It gives you a little bit of room but it's kind of a sketchy little hill. Yeah. And then once you get to the other side, it's not so bad after that. It's pretty easy. As soon as you cross the turn, then it starts to ease up. You get a lot more walking space. Um, all of a sudden, it starts to look like you're not even in a city anymore. You're more in the countryside, and there's like an alpaca farm on the right side. I've seen deer over here in the morning, uh, in the early, early mornings when I was walking to work. Um, another overgrowth patch right here where this yellow uh, wheat grass is so I got across the street right here sometimes it's a little bit of a wait sometimes it's pretty quick
it is kind of a dangerous walk, but I don't mind making it to get to work. You gotta do what you gotta do to pay the bills, so um, there's people in worse situations. Uh, it's not so bad. It's actually pretty fun in the mornings when there's not as many cars. Um, this little hill, I just cruise down it, and then we take a left to get into the property for work. Um, owner, Jason, really cool guy. Uh, helped me out with a job as a referee, and now I work as a gun tech. He hired me on. Um, he's helped me out a lot. Uh, the other managers are Jake, Morgan, and Thomas. Also, three good people. Um, it's right next to a school, so there's a school on the right with tennis court and um, a field where they have football practices and they do cross country during the springtime. I've seen a guy flying a drone out there. He's out there every other weekend flying his little drone. There's some guys that fly planes. It's pretty cool. So, walk down this little last stretch of land to get to where the field actually starts on the left hand side. This is actually a wheat grass. I'm pretty sure it's wheat grass. You guys correct me in the comments if I'm wrong, but yeah, I'm pretty sure it's wheat grass on the left side uh, that's been cut down. This is where our property actually starts. Starting with the shooting cage on the left right here, shooting range, and our sign, Impact Action Sports. And for all of you guys that are coming to visit us, it is 10 miles per hour because there is people in the parking lot, children crossing to go to the car. Make sure you follow the speed limit and wear your seatbelt. Oh, geez, excuse me. So this is my first time crack at this uh, vlog type of stuff. So a lot of talking. I'm going to need another bottle of water. <laughs> So this is what I experience every day, walking into work in the morning time. I love it. It's a beautiful day. It's Friday. And we're getting ready to work on some projects. Uh, Jake's already here, it looks like. What is up? made it in to work for the day. My task, my first task is to go down to Rolando's property and clean up some of the shells and paintball hits that accidentally got over onto his side. Very cool dude. He uh, lives, unfortunately, right next to a paintball park and he just wants his property clean. Uh, so uh, every once in a while we cruise down there and pick up after ourselves. So first thing I gotta do is grab me a bucket and this grabber from the top that I couldn't find and now I found it. 